I'm a first contact practitioner physiotherapist at Wellington Medical Practice, and we have two students in for five week placements. The first few weeks, they'll get to know the computer system, they'll get to know how referral pathways work, they'll get to know all the different ways that people are triaged. And then as the weeks progress, we get them involved with consultations with the patients. The longer throughout the placement the students get, the more independent they'll become. However, they will be supervised throughout. Because of COVID, the students can't see patients face to face. Although this is the case, we still have a lot of skills in our subjective reasoning. So talking, asking questions, asking relevant questions, getting to the bottom of a diagnosis. I think it opens up skills in other areas and really develops those skills for the students, especially. We set this placement up because FCP is a guiding star for a lot of physio practice across the board. And so by giving our students an experience of that early, we're much more likely to have a greater proportion of physios who are looking towards that as a career of choice later on. I think in physio at the moment, there's lots of physios who aren't quite sure of what happens in primary care or what those environments look like to work within. And so our plan is for our students to experience it, understand the whole remit, and be able to make a really clear decision on whether that's something they want to go with moving forwards. I like the first contact practitioner element because you can just get stuck in straight away. You're like the first person to actually see a patient. It's been a really good experience. I've really enjoyed it. So we'll get in first thing in the morning, we'll have a bit of a discussion with Joe about what sort of patients we're going to see for today and then we'll sort of break down the timetable into who's going to be seeing who. There's all sorts that goes on. It's mainly telephone consultations and then you can give exercises as well. It just varies every day. It makes me go home, practice subjects more, get a bit more understanding about the anatomy. Learning all the time, I don't think there's ever been a day where I thought I haven't learned anything. We started having a physio at the practice since 2016 and this was really a natural progression for us really because we wanted to train the next generation of primary care physiotherapists. Not just to give the physio students an exposure to physiotherapy in primary care but more about the whole primary care role and see how physios can interact and be part of the wider primary care team. They've all been enthusiastic, they've all knuckled down and got on with it. It's been a fantastic experience having students. I've really enjoyed the placement learning lots of new things. The team's fantastic here as well, they've helped develop us. Sometimes the physio as well that we're with writes on the whiteboard, so we come up with different ideas and sort of bounce off each other really, just brainstorm around ideas. We do presentations as well that we'll then feed back to Joe to show our learning. Obviously it's a fantastic opportunity because it's a relatively new role. So when it comes to my future career, this placement has made me consider going into first contact practitioner role. I found it very interesting. It's good to learn about how it works in a GP surgery. As an advanced practice physio, having students really keeps you on your toes in terms of your clinical reasoning. If I were to sit in a 15 minute consultation, I'd probably have my go-to questions that I would ask routinely. But having the students there makes you kind of think, right, if I'm asking these questions, I need to know exactly why I'm asking them, and I need to be able to teach the students why I'm asking them. It makes your practice a lot better, definitely. I really enjoyed my placement in FCP practice. I feel like it gave me really good opportunity to advance my skills, doing assessments, subjective history taking, spotting red flags. I had the chance to see many different conditions and I recommend it to anybody looking to take on a physiotherapy role. I think this placement definitely shows that advanced practice and FCP clinicians are able to take students and actually that students will support them and our students are real pioneers in terms of understanding what FCP is at undergraduate level. I'm amazed at how well our students do and the biggest thing that I get from it is that when they come back they know more about FCP than I do. That's a real big thing for us. 